The third Trot the Trails is kicking off next Saturday, and it comes with a horse trail ride this year. Joining us this morning to explain more is Andy Adams. Good morning, Andy. Thanks for being here with us. Good morning. Thanks for having me. Of course. So what exactly is Trot the Trails, for those who don't know? Okay, Trot the Trails is a local, even out-of-town horse enthusiasts come, and they bring their horses, and they ride on... This year we're going to do the former Lakeside Golf Course, which is now owned by the City of Fort Wayne, and portion of the River Greenway um, near New Haven, the Land and Road area. So once a year they open up the trails to horses. Okay. So how, how old do you have to be to participate in Trot the Trails? Uh, any age, but you have to have your own horse. There are not horses there for you to rent or use. It is bring your own horse. So if you have horses in your horse control, we had babies even last year Aww. being strapped to their moms and were ridden. Uh, so any age is really a bit, is okay. Okay, is there any cost to this event, and what about parking? So there is a cost. It is $10 uh, per person to ride. Uh, if you want to uh, just watch, you can go over to the Legion on Reed Row. They are going to have a lunch they're going to serve. Mm -hmm. There is a cost to that. So bring your cash. Uh, you can watch horses come in. You can enjoy the lunch. Uh, parking is at the former Kmart. It's the uh, 2430 surplus store is allowing us to park uh, horse trailers there. So that's the parking for the horse trailers. Okay, so besides the ride, are there any other activities? You did mention the lunch um, that guests could look forward to. Um, there's going to be uh, some miscellaneous fundraising going on, but mainly it's just get on your horse and ride. There will be lunch available, like I said, at the Legion. Um, tie up and meet with other horse enthusiasts. And how is the Three Rivers Horse Trail getting involved this year? So the Three Rivers Horse Trails is putting on the event with the City of Fort Wayne. Um, we organized the event, got the volunteers, and have it all ready, go out, map it out, and uh, have the whole thing ready for everybody. So how did this idea come about? So there's a group of horse enthusiasts uh, um, that got together and said, hey, there's no horse trails in Allen County. We are the most second per capita horse owners mm -hmm. in the state with no trails. So we got together and said, hey, Fort Wayne, will you let us have these events and open the trails up to us? So they said, sure, and they do it once a year. We're hoping maybe to have two this year. We'll see. And can people show up and participate, or do they need to sign up? Uh, you can just show up, but make sure you have your own horse. Mm -hmm. uh, just show up. The hours are from 9 until 3. Uh, most people get on the trail. You can ride the trail as much as you want. We just ask that you be gone by 3 o'clock. And this is only this one day. Okay. Thank you so much, Andy, for being here with us this morning. As she said, Trot the Trails is next Saturday from 10 to 3. The ride starts at the former Lakeside Golf Course and ends at the North River Road Trailhead. Registration is required and it starts at 9. It costs $10 per rider. More information can be found later on today on Wayne.com.